Lovely to meet you all, and thank you for joining me on this uh, free meditation. I'll give you the concept and everything um, shortly, and what we're going to do and how we're going to do it. But first of all, I always like to quieten people down and relax them. And that I feel is a very important part of this journey of what we're going to do tonight. So when I do the relaxation, I want you to do the best you can to relax. But maybe you can't let go of everything. It's fine. Do what you can do and let your body just relax. So close your beautiful eyes and just get yourself comfortable. Try not to cross your arms or cross your legs. And just close your eyes and relax. And as you relax and quiet and down, Just for a moment, become aware of your own body. Become aware of how it's feeling at this very moment. Feel where you're feeling anxieties or tensions. And just know that they're there. You don't have to put any worry about it. Just notice how your body is. And then focus on your feet. And just allow your feet to rest and relax. Just allow your feet to rest and relax. Feel your knees relaxing. Allow the knees to just relax. And then go to your thighs. Take a moment to just be aware of your thigh muscles. Allow it to rest. Relax. Let go. And as you do that, you may experience that your legs are letting go, resting, relaxing. It's part of allowing and a part of letting go. See, when you let go, you're free. Free to be who you are. And also, the body responds to that. And so you'll feel now the back muscles relaxing. Feel the lower back muscles, let them go, let them relax. The middle of your back, and then the upper part of your back. Just giving yourself that kind of permission to yourself. I can let go. I can relax. And then gently feel the abdominal organs and the glands in your stomach region. Allow them to rest, relax. And even the pelvic area Just feel all organs, all glands resting. 
you may even choose to pick one or two of them, such as your liver. Just allow your liver to relax. You don't always have to know where they are. Your mind knows. Maybe your spleen. Let it relax. Your kidneys. Your colon. Your pancreas. Allow these organs to just rest, relax, rest, relax. And as you do that, you build up your own energy. You begin to accumulate. And you accumulate an energy that can support you, to help you feel your chest relaxing, and as you allow your chest to relax, quieten down. Focus on your lungs. And your lungs have, let's say, are three levels. The bottom, the middle, and the top of your lungs. I want you just to focus on the bottom of your lungs for a moment. And just feel the lungs resting, relaxing. And you may experience your breathing becoming more rhythmic and even and slowing down. Go to the middle of your lungs. Let it relax. Rest. And then the top of your lungs. Just feel your lungs relaxing. Relaxing. Being still. And so your breathing is becoming more and more quieter and slowing down, as well as your heart. You know, the heart sometimes is under quite a lot of pressure through worries or whatever's going on in our world. Allow it right now, even though there have been trying times around Let yourself rest. Because this short period of time that we have together can be incredibly powerful for you to just recuperate, repair, and let go. Relax. And you may even notice that your heart is responding to that. It's letting go. It's quieting down. And you are letting go deeper and deeper. Because you can. You're always in control. You're allowing yourself to let go. Then, just be aware of your shoulders. Feel how your shoulders are feeling. And just let them 
rest, relax. Now go to your fingers and the palms of your hands. Feel your fingers relaxing. Let them become loose and limp and relaxed. Palms on your wrists. And right up to the elbows, relaxing. You know, when we work a lot on computers, these areas sometimes take quite a lot of strain. And so allow these muscles in your arms to relax. Let go. That's it. Just let go. And from the elbows up to your shoulder joints, relax. Quiet and down. And as you do that, you move to your neck. Your neck, all the muscles there, let them relax. Sometimes we have a neck that is stiff, tense. Sometimes we don't know which way to go in life. We're not sure looking to the left or to the right, to go forward or backwards. Allow it to become neutral, relaxed. So that when the meditation takes place, you're looking forward, letting go. Then gently, feel your mouth, the jaw, relaxing. Your lips relax, cheeks feel that area unwinding, relaxing, and then gently, gently into your eyes. Notice your eyelids and let them feel rested and relaxed. They close and they are just relaxing. Sometimes the eyelids kind of filter and move around like rapid eye movement. It's fine. Don't stop it. Let it just relax. And go into the eyeball itself and allow your eyes to relax, to become quiet, to become calm, letting go, relaxing. You may notice that you are resting far deeper now, relaxing. And then you can feel your forehead relaxing. Let your forehead quiet and down. Relax and be still even the mind. You know, focus on the left hemisphere of your brain. 
quite an interesting experience just to feel that space of the left side of your brain. You don't have to do anything, just notice. Sometimes it feels heavy, sometimes you just feel color. It's all right, whatever you perceive. Now that you've got that little bit of data about the left hemisphere, go across to the right side and experience something there. Let it rest and relax. Just feel that they may feel totally different to each other. And if that is the case, imagine you got like a, a fulcrum or, a, or like a seesaw and you just allow it to go into balance. Imagine, pretend. You can allow that to happen to yourself. And it just gently does that. And you relax. Now notice how you're feeling. Notice what's different within you. Notice how more peaceful you are. You've done the best you can. Allow yourself to just be there. Just for a moment, stay in that space. Feel it. Acknowledge it. And then, just take a nice, slow, deep breath in. And out. And one more. And out. And gently return to a full waking state. Your mind clear. Your mind clear. Open your eyes. And your mind is lovely and clear. Well done. Now, what I want to, uh, for those of you that maybe this is your first time working with me, I want to just give you a little bit of how it works when we do the meditation. And maybe you are a meditator. And that's fantastic. But if this is your first time, then if we give you a, a few kind of clues and what to expect, it can be really helpful. First thing is that I'm going to ask you to ground yourself when we go into the meditation. Now, you may wonder what is grounding. Well, the way I do it is you're going to sense the soles of your feet. So underneath the sole of your foot, you will be connecting to the earth. Whether you are on a 10 story building or on the ground floor, you will feel a vibration or a sense of something underneath the soles of your feet. And to the degree you feel it is fine. Sometimes it's very slight and sometimes it's very strong. And also, what may happen is that you feel it more on one foot and not on the other. Now, if that happens, you just allow it to cross over, and then it will balance. But I'll guide you through that. The other thing that, when I'm taking you into a meditation, is allow yourself to be free to feel what's happening inside you. A lot of times, in meditation, you go into a very quiet space. 
which is what I want you to do, but also you are able to explore when you are in that quiet space. So you notice what you experience as I take you to different levels of awareness. And, you know, when you're going into these states, maybe you've never done it before, and it's fine. You will enter where you're capable of going. It's not a right nor a wrong. Just have fun with what I want to take you to. Now, the concept that I want to take you into is your journey. Where you are right now. Now, all of us, to some degree or another, have had to evaluate, think about where we are, what's been going on the planet, and how do I go from here? And it is a contrast that you and I are going through. We are evaluating, sensing, and maybe we've really gone into quite a difficult time. I want you to just trust yourself for this session to just be relaxed and allow yourself to sense things, to feel things, and to allow the journey of what we're going to do together to guide you to something amazing for yourself. Try not to be too analytical, maybe how I'm doing it, because everybody's got a unique way of doing meditations. So try not to do any of that, but allow yourself to just be in that amazing space for yourself. And remember, there's a big group of you, so we collective. So on that good note, have a sip of water, get yourself comfortable. Okay. <clears throat> so now just gently close your eyelids and just take a moment to let yourself rest. What is important, as best as you can, is to allow yourself to be still as best as you can through this meditation. If we move around too much by distractions, it can hinder you and stop you from experiencing more. Now, focus underneath the soles of your feet and allow yourself to connect to the earth. Take your time and you'll feel a warmth, maybe a coolness, a tingle, some kind of sensation underneath the soles of your feet. It's really fun. Allow yourself to feel it. Now, if one foot is feeling it more than the other, just by intention, tell it to go across to the other foot and it will balance. Now become aware of your bottom or your backside. And imagine you can feel yourself sitting in that chair as if you've just been pulled downwards into your body. That's it. And now become aware that we have this beautiful group around us. And maybe we could imagine them as 
this beautiful circle of people. I mean, why not? Imagine this lovely group. Because they're going to be more that have booked, but can't do it tonight because they're in different parts of the world. And so you're connecting to everybody as best as you can from your heart. be open to that. And then gently you have energies called chakras of your body. We're not going to go too much into them. But we're going to focus on it more with a color than anything else. If you're inclined and you know a bit more, you could spin them, but it's not necessary. I want you to focus on the bottom one, which is very close to your coccyx, the bottom of your spine. And it's beautiful red. So kind of feel the space of red bottom of your spine. This is your foundation in life, the building block. If we don't have a foundation, if we don't have that energy, we can't move forward. Feel Maybe a bit of warmth around your bottom as you activating this energy. And like all these energies, you're doing it to the level of your awareness, your spiritual growth. As you do that, and as you're quietening down, I want you to become aware of your solar plexus. And that is near your belly button. And imagine a beautiful yellow. And just take your time either picturing a yellow color. Allow yourself to feel this yellow. Sense it. Some people even get a smell. Feel that power. Very good. Do the best you can. And now, the top of your head. Right on the top of your head. A violet color. You can't really grasp that color in your imagination. Pick a white ball. And just allow yourself to feel that. A connection to your spirit. And as you are feeling that, I want you to move to your heart, the organ of the heart. And allow yourself to be open. You may experience, as you're feeling it, an expansion, a sense of opening of your heart. Allow yourself to just be gentle. In a way, allow yourself to be humble. Allow yourself to be open 
to a possibility and you change for yourself. You may experience right now a feeling of space around you. A sense of there's more around me. As if I'm feeling very guided and protected. Maybe you are very conscious of seeing that you're not alone, that you're being held by spirit. I consciousness. Because you are becoming conscious right now and more and more. Opening yourself to something beautiful. Allowing yourself to be more. You may notice too that you're drifting more and more in a very clear, calm space. A space of your own truth. Not my truth, not somebody else's. Your own. Your own journey of where is happening to you right now. Your journey. And imagine that you are on a pathway that may be in a forest or wherever you want to Imagine yourself walking. And this pathway is pretty big. Don't make it small. You can alter it. Because it's your imagination. If you look ahead, you just see it's a straight path. Maybe meandering a little bit, but Stray. I want you just to be aware as you're walking along this path. Can you sense the what's underneath your feet? Can you feel maybe roots, stones, however you you're walking? And as you're doing that, I want you a little bit further along. You're going to notice a fork in the pathway. Going to the right or going to the left. Like a V in the pathway. So it is splitting itself. And allow yourself to walk casually towards this fork in the road. And just for a moment, when you're there, Become still. Allow yourself to just feel like you're slowing down and you feel a deep feeling of being in your own truth. A sense of stillness and a sense of knowing. 
don't judge anything, but to allow yourself to just be standing at a change in your life, your journey. Maybe at this point in your beautiful life, you've got a few challenges, and it's okay. These are the possibilities for yourself. I want you to look at the left one and just put your focus on the left pathway. Ignore the right side at the moment. The left path is where you are in your life right now. Maybe this pathway is something you're very excited about because new ideas have come to you. And maybe it's a part in your life that you're not too sure of where it's leading me. I want you to enter on that path. Just walk along it for a short while. And just feel, become aware how your body is feeling in this space. Has it become a little bit more anxious? Has it become more relaxed that I'm on the right path? There's no right and wrong which path you take. Just notice from your physical body what you're feeling. Take your time. Experience what you're feeling there. Try not to become intellectualized. And try to figure that out with your brain. Allow yourself to just notice what you're feeling. Sometimes our heart increases in speed. Sometimes you just feel so peaceful. Take a note. This is your journey, where you are right now. And maybe this is your journey to continue there. And be at peace with what you are perceiving. Now, turn around and come back. And just notice you on the, the V. And I want you to go into the right shortly. Not yet. I'll just give you some information. The right one is something new. Something maybe you're not too sure about. You know, for me sometimes, I've been at a loss as to where to go. What is the next thing to do? And sometimes in that space, we have to let go. Not to give up, but just to let go. If you are like that right now, and you're not too sure, I want you as best as you can to just let go and trust your heart and your spirit. Because when I ask you to take a step in the right direction, it's a possibility of something amazing coming your way. And it is your journey, not for me, but for you. 
So get ready, and when you feel ready, step onto the right fork and walk a little way into that pathway. You may experience a sense of lightness, And as you walk a little bit further, I want you to imagine in front of you shortly, you imagine a table in front of you. Just imagine. It's fun. And if you look on that table, Maybe you see a book. Maybe you see a little bit more of what you're about to do in your life. Maybe what you are feeling is that you know there is a calendar in front of you. And you look at the calendar, you can see that in the next few years, it's going to be very, very successful. Maybe it's going to be starting in this month or next month. Allow yourself to just play. Can you get a sense at this beautiful table. Maybe you have picture frames there. And when you look into the frame, you see a picture of yourself being very confident, clear in your mind. Where you're going to be working with lots of people maybe, or maybe it's such a brilliant idea that it's just for you to expand and to do. Maybe for the first time you want to start moving into the metaphysics and allow yourself to be more of a teacher. Maybe it's a time where you are going to open your heart a bit more and to develop. To open your spirituality. To allow yourself to explore. Feel. Have that fun. Notice what you're feeling. Now, if you're not feeling anything, that's not wrong or right. It may be. You just need to do this again over the next few days. And you'll get a better idea of something, because sometimes, for me and maybe for you, we try too hard to see. It's fine. Your guidance system may even tonight or over the next couple of weeks show you in your dreams where you are venturing, where you're moving to, what is becoming of you. But it is your journey and your guidance system, who you are, is what you need to know, is always there. You can never fail. It's just that sometimes journeys, where we are, have come to an end so that a new one can begin. And maybe. 
you have reached a particular point in your beautiful life that a new project is coming to you. Can you feel the space that you've entered? Can you feel how maybe still you have become? Now, it doesn't matter whether you were on the left path or the right path. There is no correct side. But you have noticed both. Does it feel that the left and what you are doing in your life is exactly where I need to carry on. As an example, like myself, where I'm doing this kind of work, do I need to change? Possibly not. But something new unfolds for me. And so maybe that is what's happening to you when you are on the left side. But as you've explored the right side, you have other possibilities of how your abilities may open up more and more. And there are also endless possibilities. Just feel, explore. And no. You may be feeling a sense of openness for yourself. And what I want you to do is to walk around the table and just carry on walking a little bit further, leaving everything behind you. Walk your own talk. And as you do that, you will sense, as you just stand still now, that you feel as if you're in a beautiful bubble of light. And this kind of bubble is supporting you. And gently it begins to float. And you feel yourself not touching on either side of this bubble. It's kind of like a translucent white energy around you. Allow yourself to be aware. As you kind of float a little bit higher and a little bit higher, your awareness has shifted. You can also call it your resonance has changed. And so going a little bit higher gives you a new viewing point of how you're moving in your life. And from this higher perspective of yourself, I want you to look downwards and see your path. Can you see how your path is going? Is it going beautifully straight? Sometimes life takes you this way and that way. But maybe you just get a sense of, wow, my new journey, a new beginning. And you allow yourself to just 
be there for a moment in that expanded space. Yes, it's an expanded space of awareness. And you may be experiencing, all of you, if you look around in that group, that you just see these bubbles all around in a beautiful circle. And each one has a unique perspective for themselves. And each one of us has a unique journey on this planet. And you are feeling at peace. I want you to really, as best as you can, notice how you are experiencing looking slightly into the future and knowing that all is going to be okay for you. If you're not sensing it, put that into your mind. I'm going to be fine. I'm going to find the unique passion. I'm going to be okay. And feel your own guidance system. And feel how your body is responding and relaxing. These will be your clues. How you are going to manifest something new for yourself. It's not a right world. It's just as it is. And you also may be changing many, many times because you're excited in doing this and that. Now you Maybe you're a very young person and you this is the beginning of your life. You allow yourself to go onto the crest of that wave and you allow yourself to make it. And gently feel how peaceful you are and calm. Now, gently, gently. Hold that space. Keep it in your heart. And then feel yourself returning to a waking state by just taking a deep breath in and out. In. And out. And when you're ready, open your eyes to a full waking state. To a full waking state. Well done. Well done.